<coughs> what up, guys? It's Grim Reaper, and I wanted to bring you another episode. This one a little, a little bit more about me. Um, within the the pot book, it <coughs> does an overview of a different uh, uh, chronic health conditions in which cannabis is used for, and this is what I use it for. <coughs> 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 If you haven't uh, learned from my other videos, I have Tourette's Syndrome. Tourette's Syndrome is a complex neurological disorder, the cause of which remains essentially unknown. The disease is characterized by tics which are involuntarily repeated movements and verbal expressions that occur spontaneously without warning. The severity of the disease is variable, but in its worst, exper worst expression, it can be quite disabling. As with ALS and MS, there is no cure for Tourette's syndrome. However, unlike ALS and MS, the condition often improves with age. Uh, the tics that I have are, it's a vocal grunt. It's, it's really hard to explain. Um, I have my neck twitches, which I, I kind of jerk my neck forward. I roll my wrists around my ankles. Um, and I, I have some hand fidgets, and uh, normally people with Tourette's Syndrome, it's normal for them to have cases of obsessive compulsive disorder, along with attention deficit disorder, and sleeping problems, and anxiety and depression, which I all suffer from, and which cannabis helps completely. And I'll keep going on Tourette's Syndrome. Tourette syndrome is estimated to affect approximately 100,000 people in the United States. There have been numerous studies published investigating the use of cannabinoids for the treatments, treatment of TS. Starting in the late 1990s, Muller, Vall, and colleagues pu published a number of papers clearly showing the efficacy of cannabis in treating Tourette syndrome. Cannabis appears to decrease the tick severity score or TSS. This is a reliable, uh, reproducible, standardized rating scale to describe tick frequency and magnitude of movements. Uh, the, patients have, the patients also experience an overall improvement in global functioning. In one, in one case report a single dosage of 10 milligrams of Delta 9 THC, the 25 year old man with severe uncontrolled TS drop the subject's total TSS from 41 to 7, an 84% improvement. That's incredible. Within two hours following ingestion of the cannabinoid, uh, the improvement was observed for a total of seven hours. The similar effect was also seen in patients following inhalation, smoking of marijuana, confirmed again using the TSS scale. The results continue to be positive even in random, randomized, double-blind, uh, placebo-controlled crossover single-dosage trial of THC in 12 adults TS patients. Uh, the investigators reported a significant improvement in TSS as well as a decrease in obsessive-compulsive behavior after treatment with Delta-9 THC compared to placebo. Investigators reported no cog cognitive impairment in subjects following THC administration, including THC is effective and safe in treating tics and OCB, which is obsessive compulsive behavior, in TS. In a second randomized double blind placebo controlled trial involving 24 patients who were administered daily dosages of up to 10 milligrams of THC. Over a six-week period, research report reported that subject experienced a significant reduction in TSS following long-term cannabinoid treatment with no impairment of learning, recall, or verbal memory. 
there was actually a st statistically significant improvement in verbal memory span both during and after cannabinoid therapy. So, um, I know, not, not personally, but I really want to talk to them. Other people on YouTube that are dealing with uh, Tourette's syndrome, and they further uh, spread the information on Tourette's, and I, I hope they please watch this, because cannabis does help Tourette's syndrome patients, and it needs to be known that we can use a natural medicine, and not this like dangerous random chemicals that it it knows like we know that it's not curable but cannabis can help us and it's been shown an 84 percent increase and you guys have seen most of my videos and i think i've only ticked once it's just incredible how much it helps me like I, I know another person on here, Elmist, uh, Elitist, maybe I'm saying it wrong, but it really helps him. And he's living in a state where it's not accepted medically, and that's just, that's sad. Like, you can watch his videos. He has it much more severe than I do, and he deserves it a hell of a lot more than I do. I will, I will admit that. He, he's in real need of this. So please... Let's educate everybody. Let's educate and medicate. Pass on the information. Peace.